My name's Dan Magnus and I'm a football freestyler. It's great to be here today at Wembley School. Fantastic, not long now till I start. I'm trying to break a world record for longest journey travelled while keeping up a football, um, using my head, my knees and my feet and sometimes my shoulders. I've got to keep the ball in constant motion. I'm going to be travelling while doing keepy uppies the whole way from here all the way up to Manchester. So uh, it's going to be quite a long route, I think it's about 200 miles. We're stopping off a few times along the way and basically all we're trying to do is raise as much money as possible for UNICEF and also to get people keeping it up for Soccer Aid um, and doing their own thing as well to raise money. So whatever you can do, whether it's keepy uppies with a football, whether it's keeping up your homework, get sponsored for it and let's raise some money. Fantastic, yeah, brilliant. We have our like, largest audience from China. Can you say hi to them? Hello, people in China. I'm Dan Magnus, raising money for UNICEF, walking today from Wembley Stadium all the way up to Manchester. 20 to 30 miles a day, um, doing this the whole way. Dum, dum, if I'm dum. doing this, maybe 10 seconds. Yeah, <laughs> give it a go. Try. Okay, try. Ah! <laughs> I've got my laces tucked in, my socks pulled up, I'm ready to go. So, three, two, one, and we're off. Come on, Dan, well, I've done it. Oh, I dropped it. The main challenge of today is to get out of London. Um, we're going up to St Albans today, um, so I've got to find my way there first. Then we're going to sleep overnight, and then tomorrow we're going to make our way up to Milton Keynes. What's it say on here? This is Summer Street, look. So oh, we've okay. come here, so yeah. I'm assuming that should be Kingsbury Road, but it's not. Oh, it's man. Tudor Gardens, but we're on right. What's that? So right I think there? we need to go down there. Yeah, this is my wife, Julie. <laughs> She's a navigator. And uh, yeah, she's been looking after me very well so far. Yes. She taught me everything I know. I retired from doing this ages ago. Direction, basically, just right to make to sure you're going the right way. And also there's a lot of dodgy paving slabs. The secret for this challenge is basically just to keep plodding away. I mean, you can't, every single bit of energy has to be put on driving forward um, towards the end goal. So you've also got to keep your concentration um, to a maximum as well. All the time, you've got to concentrate on what you're doing, where you're going, and uh, yeah, just make sure I don't get run over and all is a big point. So uh, yeah, I wouldn't want that. <laughs> Legs feel like flaming beautiful, just right. Well, I can't actually tell if they feel beautiful or if they've just got numb and I can't feel them. And you've got to keep going. Right, baby, we'll make it up. You're back on a curve now. I can see. Oh, yeah. Oh. Whoa. Woohoo! I don't. Oh. There's a bit of showing off there. You like that? Whoop. Off the car. well as a team we do work well as a team we have a bit of a laugh a bit of a joke on the way a bit of a sing song uh, so yeah we just we just put each other really so yeah teamwork come on literally nothing left so we just arrived here in St Albans it's been a brilliant day we've had some uh, hiccups along the way but we got there in the end we've all plugged together and we've managed to get there so um, absolutely over the moon fantastic great day can't wait for tomorrow